This is lesson three, picking up where we left off. Uh, what I'm looking at is a section that's uh, four feet above the 80 inch we decided that was the elevation of the floor plate for level one. If I change component edit uh, and check hide rest of model, if I decide, for example, to double click the floor plane, this rectangle uh, is bounded face that I decided was the floor slab for level one, and decide to make it edit, make it a um, component. Let's make it a component, give it a name. Floor slab one. Create. Okay, if I double click it, it's going to hide the rest of my model. So this is convenient. Why? Because I can assign a thickness to it. Say I decide to extrude it downwards 12 inches. 12. Enter. I'm going to close that component. So I have a floor slab there that is at my you know, level one. Um, I can subsequently define the same for levels two and three. This is only three-story building. How does that help me? Um, I love creating scenes, so that's it. Level one, see-through, for now, for lack of a better Okay, let's uh, view, turn off section plans, view, turn off section cuts, non-x-ray. So this thing is my floor slab for level one. Presumably I could copy it to level two if I could figure out what the elevation of level two is. If I decided that it was here to there, it's 22 feet above, it appears Be the elevation for the one. Let's copy it. In the blue axis, tap your control key and say 22 feet. Let's see where we want to put level 3. We think it might be to there, another 16 feet more or less. You can go with provisional theory, so I'm going to make a, a, a copy of that um, in the Z direction. Tap the control key, 16 feet from there. Right. So if I cut a section through here, let's save this view. See. I saw I symmetric. So I haven't saved this file yet, I better do so. File save as I'm gonna put it in the handouts for the and else. Urban shells. Do you think 
Let's make a folder and call it work. Well, SketchUp. Um, if I were to turn section cuts back on and section planes back on, and let's say I decided to do a oh, vertical section through the building, we create a new section plane, let's go that way, select it move it to a useful place somewhere in the center beyond the columns because I want to model those columns so here's what I've got so far Create a scene, section three, building one. Um, X-ray mode is showing us that the. Uh, you know, clearly the middle area is open, so we have to modify those slabs, and these are components, so any modification of any one is going to propagate to the others, so we'll probably have to make two and three unique. Let's save this lesson three, and hopefully folks understand that you know how hierarchically I'm moving through these 3D models.